Have you ever run out of drugs? I'm going to keep my pimp hands strong and keep doing that to me. Oh, no. <laughs> um, have you ever run out of drugs? If so, um, you've probably experienced an evocative effect of drug-seeking behavior. <laughs> we need to get some in. <laughs> right? No, um, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> wow, TMI, sorry. Um, so no, seriously, like, it, w it w <laughs> fine, we'll just go with the example. If you've been doing lines of coke all night long, no, uh, I'm sorry, uh, let's try something a little more legal. Evocative effect simply means that you're experiencing a motivation operation that's going to get you to engage in a particular response. It's going to increase the probability that it's going to increase that response. Because remember, motivating operations change the value of a reinforcer, right? So by changing the value of the reinforcer, then you increase the frequency of a response or decrease it. If you're increasing the frequency of the response, you have an evocative effect, right? So you're gonna do more. So as you're coming down off of whatever drug it is that you want, even cup, oh, look, <laughs> coffee. So as I run out of coffee, trust me, my body starts going, where's more coffee? I start looking around the room and doing all this and that and driving around even quicker to try to find more coffee stents, an evocative effect. Decreasing the presence of it makes me want to get more, right? So, evocative effect. You get it, I hope. Maybe. If not, then ask a question.